Hey guys, this is CG Animator, and today I'm going to show you how to make cloth in Blender. So before I get started, please comment and rate this video. Check out my channel for more videos and tutorials, and subscribe to my page and add me if you like my stuff. Okay, cool. Let's get started. So first thing you want to do is you want to put this cube to a different layer because we're going to need it later. So just press M to move. Press 2. Press OK, and that means it moved it to the second layer. And these are all the move the um layers that you can move it to. So you want to add a plane, stretch it on the x axis by pressing S, X, hold it on the y axis for S, Y. That's good. Now go into edit mode, press W to bring up the specials tab, and press subdivide a couple times. That's good. And then go here go on this tab with you can go here with um, F9 or something no wait forget what I said but anyway so press cloth and these are the different types of cloth that you can have if you don't want to do it manually I like uh, silk looks the best if you press alt A it just goes down and that doesn't work but if we add an object and one to bring it back, you can switch between these just by clicking here. Scale this down a little bit and bring it down. If you press Alt A to play, it goes right through it. So we have to press the Q, go to collision, press collision. Press Alt A. And that my computer doesn't process cloth very well, so that's all I can subdivide with you, you still being able to see it. Now, if you don't want that, then you can have it hang from itself. And how you do that is go to weight paint, and then you paint the edges. Well, actually, turn it, make sure it's on add, and you do the edges. You can change all these settings in the editing tab here. And do all that. That's good. Now go to the cloth menu and press pinning of cloth. Press Alt A, and as you can see, it stays there. And that's all there's to cloths. I mean, you can, if you think you have a really strong computer, you can enable self collisions, which means it collides with itself if it happens to touch itself, like if it would go down on a cube and the bottom parts would touch each other, they would collide with each other. And there's different stuff that you can do, and you can bake it, which is pretty much just like playing animation, but you can see it better. And that's all there is to that. So please comment and rate this video, message me, comment me if you have any questions, check out my page for more tutorials and videos, and that's it. Thanks for watching.